somewhere, hidden amongst thorny brambles, is a little kingdom of elves and fairies. Everyone who lives here is very, very small. I'm Ben Elf. And I'm Princess Holly. <laughs> Come on, let's play. Wait for us. <laughs> And Holly's Little Kingdom. Today's adventure starts at the meadow. Big Ben and Holly. <laughs> Catch Holly. <laughs> Catch Ben. <laughs> Let's play football. Okay. I'll magic the ball a bit bigger. Uh, hang on. I'm still holding it. Don't worry, Ben. I'll be very careful. Whoa! Oops! Holly! Now I'm big! Sorry, Ben. It was an accident. We can't play together like this. OK. I'll make myself big too. Whoa! <laughs> Great! Now we're both big. <gasps> Who's that? <laughs> <gasps> Big people are coming! Shall we hide? I don't think we can. We're too big. What shall we do? Uh, oh, <laughs> it's just Lucy. Hello, Lucy. Hello. Who are you? <laughs> Lucy, it's us. Ben and Holly. Oh, yes. But you're so big. I made us big with a spell. Wow, that's great. I'm here with my friends, Katie and Yasmin. <laughs> Do you want to meet them? But big people aren't meant to know about little people like us. But I know about you. You're special. Don't worry, you look just like big people. They'll never know. OK, but we mustn't tell them any of our elf and fairy secrets. <laughs> Hello. These are my friends, Ben and Holly. I'm Yasmin. And I'm Katie. I like your fairy outfit. Thanks. Where do you live? In a fairy castle. You live in a fairy castle? Holly! Uh, I mean, I live in a house. Where do you live, Ben? I live in a tree. A tree? I mean, a block of flats. We call it the tree. I live in a block of flats too, but we call it a block of flats. I like your elf costume, especially the ears. Are you going to a fancy dress party? Uh... Come on, everyone. Let's play catch. Katie, catch! <laughs> to you, Yasmin. <laughs> to you, Ben. Oh, I threw it too far. Don't worry. I've got it. Ooh. Wow. You can run really fast. And jump really high. That's because I'm an elf. Ben. I mean, that's because I keep fit. <laughs> <laughs> Holly, can you run fast? No, but I can fly. Holly, remember, you can't really fly. Oh, yes. I can do magic. Ooh, magic. I like magic tricks. Show us a trick, then. Are you sure you can do magic, Holly? Of course. Are you really sure? Yes. Hocus pocus. Wow. Holly, you'll give away that we're not normal big people. Oh, sorry. That's an amazing trick. How is it done? <laughs> is this a trick ball? Uh, it's a secret. A magician never gives away their secrets. Ooh. Ooh. Lucy, home time. That's my dad. We have to go now. It was nice to meet you, Ben and Holly. Bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Ben, should I shrink us back to normal size? No, I like being big. I never want to be small again. <laughs> Me too. Dum de dum de do. Diddly diddly do. Hi, Strawberry. Ah, a big person. Come back, Strawberry. It's only us. Strawberry. Giants are coming. Giants are coming. What's the matter, 
strawberry. Oh, Dad, I just saw two huge big people coming this way. Yeah, big people with their big feet. And you never know where they're going to step with those big feet. Hello, everyone. It's only us. Oh, Ben and Holly. But you're big. Holly magic dust big. And we're going to stay big. That's very nice. But would you mind lifting your foot up? Oh, I stepped on you. Sorry, Mr Mayor. That's quite all right, Princess Holly. But if you're going to stay big, you'll need to watch those feet of yours. Holly! Home time! Oh, that's Nanny. Bye, everyone. <coughs> Home time! And that's my mum. See you tomorrow. Feet, feet, feet. Oops. That was close. Sorry. Bye. Bye. Ah! Oh, big people! Sound the alarm! Big people! Big people! Lock your doors! It's OK, Mum. It's me. Oh, Ben! How did you get so big? Holly magic to me bigger. Well, you can't come inside like that. Can Holly make you small again? I don't want her to. I've decided to stay big forever. Oh, well, it's your life, I suppose. Do you want some dinner? Yes, please. You've got a lovely large pie for dinner today. There you go. Haven't you got anything bigger? What are you talking about? That's a huge pie. Uh, I think my tummy is a bit bigger than it was. Well, your tummy might have to go without. I'm used to feeding Ben the elf, not Ben the giant. Ooh, oh, no, no. No. Hello, I'm home. Ah, a giant! A giant! No, Daddy, it's me. My goodness, Holly! What happened to you? I magicked myself big and I want to stay big forever. Ah! Watch where you put those big feet. Holly, you almost stepped on Nanny. Oops, sorry, Nanny. Holly, are you really sure you want to stay big forever? Yes. It's almost bedtime. How are you going to fit in your little bed? I know, Mummy. I'll sleep outside. OK, but you'll need to keep warm. How about I magic you up a giant sleeping bag? Yes, please, Nanny. Oh, lovely. I'll sleep out here under the stars. Good night, Holly. Good night. Ah, this is cosy. I hope Ben has found somewhere nice to sleep as well. Calling all elves! Stop making toys! We need a giant sleeping bag! Right Who is this enormous sleeping bag for? Ben Elf. He's a giant person now. Oh, they grow up so fast these days. Ben, grab hold of this and pull! A giant sleeping bag. It's great. Thanks, everyone. Our pleasure. Elves are good at making giant sleeping bags. And, and we're, we're elves. elves. Ah! Ah! Maybe don't toot your horn when you're so big. Now sleep well. Good night. Good night. It is fun being big. I can't wait till morning. Princess Holly, time to get up. Oh, where are you? I'm here. The spell must have worn off and now I'm little again. Oh, never mind, Holly. Big is overrated in my opinion. I'm going to see if Ben has shrunk too. Ben, where are you? I'm here. The spell wore off in the night. Oh. Now we're little again. Well, at least you'll be able to have breakfast. Yes, breakfast. Thanks, Mum. Mmm, I didn't realise how hungry I was. I do like being small. Me too. <laughs> 
That's Lucy. Do you want to play? Morning, Lucy. Oh, you're tiny again. Yes, we are. We decided we like being little after all. Actually, I think I like you being little too. You're just the right size for an elf and a fairy. And you're just the right size for a big person. <laughs> Somewhere hidden amongst thorny brambles is a little kingdom of elves and fairies. Everyone who lives here is very, very small. I'm Ben Elf. And I'm Princess Holly. <laughs> Come on, let's play. Wait for us. <laughs> ben and Holly's Little Kingdom. Today's adventure starts at the Little Castle. Daisy and Poppy go bananas. Making that awful noise! Bang! Bang! <laughs> oh, this is too loud! Daisy, Poppy, I'm taking your wands away and putting them in the cupboard. <laughs> Mummy is right. No more wands until you learn to use them properly. Ah, oh, finally, a bit of peace and quiet. Oh, who's that? Ahem. Granny Thistle is here. Oh, no! My mother! Granny Thistle! Granny! Granny! Granny. Darlings, darlings, darlings. Marvellous to see you. Holly, give your Granny a hug. <laughs> Hello, Granny Thistle. Oh, young Ben Elf. Always a pleasure to see you. What's wrong with the twins? Why are you so sad? Wandy, Wandy. <gasps> Where are your wands? I've taken them away for now. But how will they do magic without wands? Uh, maybe it's better if Daisy and Poppy don't do magic. Well, they're your children, darling, and the last thing I want to do is interfere. At least Holly has a wand. <laughs> Oh, yes. Holly's having magic lessons from me. What have you learned, Holly? I can turn people into frogs. Or rabbits. Frogs? You're still on frogs? And rabbits. But that's baby magic. What about the hard stuff, like putting pink spots in the sky? <laughs> or making the trees sing? La, 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 la. No, thank you, Mother. We don't have much need for singing trees. La, la. Or pink spots in the sky. OK, you're the boss. Anyway, I've brought presents. Presents for the children. Presents! Holly, I've brought you this beautiful ring. Thank you. Is it magical? Um, maybe a little. Just don't rub it, OK? OK. And for Daisy and Poppy, two grown-up wands. Wandy! Wandy! But we've just taken their wands away. Yes, it's lucky I came when I did. These wands belonged to your great-grandparents, Vlad the Powerful and Sharon the Totally Insane. Not dangerous, are they? Only as dangerous as the person who waves them. <laughs> <laughs> right, I think we'd better put these straight in the cupboard. Oh, well, of course, you know best. And it's past your bedtime. Mm. Come on, up to bed. Now for your bedtime story. Little Bunny Bunting. Darling, would you mind awfully if I read the twins the story? Uh, oh, yes, of course. How kind. But uh, try not to get them too excited. They're meant to be going to sleep. Of course. Leave it to me. Once upon a time, there lived a rabbit called Little Bunny Bunting. Sounds a bit boring to me. <laughs> 
This is the book that I had when I was a little girl. Crazy spells for the under fives. <laughs> Spell number one, how to make a storm. Ooh. What a day. Where's Granny now? Uh, she's with the twins. Oh, is that such a good idea? After me, wave your wands. <laughs> Wandy. No wands? Oh, of course. Mummy and Daddy knew best and took your wands away. Never mind. Here's mine. Wandy. Say, thunder, thunder, thunder. Thunder, thunder, thunder. I wonder if that had something to do with Granny. Hello, is Holly coming out to play? Hello, Ben. She'll be down in a minute. Did you hear the storm last night? Hear it? It was in our bedroom. A storm in a bedroom? Cool. It was a magical storm. Good morning, Mother. I already know the answer to this, but who showed them how to make a magical storm? Me. What a surprise. Only a little indoor weather, darling. Nothing to worry about. What else did you teach them? Oh, just a few harmless little spells. Hi, everyone. Hello, Holly. Morning, Ben. Ah, why are there two Hollies? Daisy and Poppy did a spell on me. We asked them not to, but they did it anyway. This is what happens when Daisy and Poppy do magic. So, it's a little doubling spell. No harm done. It's not like there's ten Hollies. Morning. 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 And if there were, wouldn't that be nice? Wandy, Wandy! Where did they get the wand from? Oh, it seems to be my wand. Bye-bye! <laughs> They've disappeared! The twins have escaped! <laughs> <laughs> They're out in the wild! Sound the Daisy and Poppy alarm! This is all a big fuss over nothing. Oh, yes! The twins are out there somewhere and they've got your wand. What other spells did you teach them? Ah, uh, I did mention something about walking trees. Tree go walkies! Walkies! Trees are walking towards the little castle. I don't want to hear it. It's like a bad dream. I suppose this is your doing, Nanny Plum. No, it was Granny Thistle. Hello there. Granny Thistle, I might have known. It's been a long time. Cedric. Not long enough, Millicent. You always were a troublemaker. Yes, Mother. You started this. Now you have to sort it out. OK, you're the boss. I just think children should have a bit of fun. That's all. There's good fun and bad fun. This is bad fun. <laughs> My goodness. Daisy and Poppy, you're a long way from home. Bunny Rabbit. <laughs> ah! Daisy and Poppy are going bananas! <laughs> bananas! I'm a banana! <laughs> oh, darlings! There you are! I see you've been doing lots of fab magic. Chicken! Quack, quack! What? Oh, wonderful! <laughs> Oh, I'm a hedgehog. Groovy. <laughs> Pebbles. You've turned me to stone. Maybe not so good. <laughs> Holly, I think it's time for you to rub that ring now. What's she saying? The ring? Rub the ring? I think she's saying rub the ring. But didn't you say not to rub the ring? 
changed my mind. It's not good fun anymore. Grab the ring. All right, here we go. Huh? What happened? We're back in the little castle and everything's back to normal. No walking trees or spots in the sky. Yes, Holly rubbed the magic ring. It turned everything back as it was. That is some powerful ring. Yes, the ring belonged to your great-grandfather, Neville the Naughty. Ah, <laughs> oh, look at the little darlings. They're all tired out. Story, story. You'd like a story? Of course. My darlings, dangerous magic for toddlers. How long is my mother staying for? Two weeks. Chapter one: How to turn mice into dragons. <laughs> dragon, dragon. <laughs> <laughs>